this is this is zebiotic shit, hey? They uh, the f YouTube guys get paid money to support this shit. I don't believe it works. Well, we're gonna fucking find out. <laughs> we're going to find out. Well, it tastes like ass. It isn't great, uh, but we'll find out. Shot. Another shot. Bam. Okay, we're gonna start with some B Tech. You know, Thomas H. Handy, 23. William LaRue Weller, 23. Wow. And Pappy, 15, because it's not really B Tech, but. So we'll put Pappy enough. We'll put wow. on the right here. We'll, oh. And we'll probably just start like half an ounce, right? Because we probably Do you don't want to measure. I can measure. Nah, fuck it. Cool. I don't get those zebiotics are gonna fucking hopefully do this shit, but I oh. doubt it. <laughs> the after footage might be kind of interesting. Yeah, I think as we get along here, it's gonna get interesting. <laughs> Told your children to follow. I said they can follow to watch their dad vomit up really expensive uh, <laughs> alcohol, they can just come next door. <laughs> yeah. YouTube is, uh, it's an older, it's an older generation game at this point. My kids don't YouTube as much as I do. We do. Like, yeah. What do they do? They, they ticky talk or something? Of course. Mm. So let's start with the tomato handy. It's a rye, Buffalo Trace rye. So you, did you pour mine in? Yeah, no, I went that way. Okay. Yeah. So this is. So that's, that's in that order there. I thought we'd put them out there. Okay. So Sweet. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Smells great. It does smell good. It has that ethanol smell that you know it's just gonna accompany a good time. Mmm. Mm. It's, mm. it's nice, it's nice and definitely a raw AA. I mean definitely it's spicy. Yeah, spicy. but not uh not extraordinarily, especially right at first. It it definitely ends that way, but at first it's pretty just smooth. Mm. I should have spec I should have checked the specs on it, but I think it is about 120 proof. So it's fairly, it's fairly up there. Does not that is that does not feel 120. No. From what I hear, this year's Thomas H. Handy was one of the best. It does not suck. Although you could say that about every whiskey that's on the counter tonight. Yeah, yeah. We've got a lot of a lot of good whiskeys here. I don't know whether we should have started with the bottles. We should have started with the samples, but fuck it, we're starting with the samples. Yeah, that uh, that 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 sip was a little more proofy. I could taste it a little more. I don't know if that was a power of suggestion or not. Mm. <laughs> second second sip of the night too. Oh no, we had a we had a we had a starter. Yeah, we had a little, little full starter. Yeah. That's good. I think that, you know, for fucking, once again, if you can get it. So good. You can get it MSRP, buy the shit out of yeah. it. Yeah. And even, I think I I didn't pay MSRP, but I don't think I was, it's one of the cheaper VTACs. It's not like, yeah. it's not it's not over a thousand. It's like, I think four to 500 bucks, which it's not bad in this day and age. Yeah, I'd say I'd drink it. Mm -hmm. Now this one is, I <laughs> fear, this is William LaRue Weller. 23. 23. Oh, pack me my water there. So this is good old William LaRue Weller. This is, this is fucking top, top of the Weller lineup. Wheated bourbon, that smells completely different. Yeah. Still, this, this should somewhat, this is Peppy 15, so this is William LaRue Weller. This, this is probably the same sort of age, but barrel proof. Yeah. What is the proof of this? I think this one is also around the 120 mark. It, it's, it smells proofy. It, it's, uh, it smells hotter than that one did. Mm. 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 Doesn't have that rice spice. <laughs> no. Oh. Mm. That has some, uh... mm. what is that flavor? See, I'm not like, you yeah, know, the flavor thing, I'm not good at it. so hard the way. It's def definitely different. It so tastes different. Like, so, like there's caramel, mm. for sure, and vanilla. I mean, but I feel like there's always caramel and vanilla, so yep. you're always saying that. Like, I could pick out some sort of fruit if I could just pick out the fruit. Like, maybe a strawberry or some shit. I 
don't think strawberry, no, but they're... maybe a stone fruit, maybe Some like sort of, peachy. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, you're right. There's a fruity note to that. Compared to that other one. Fruity note. We're, you heard yeah. it here. There's fruits in here. Mm. Uh, and aromas. It's got them. Yeah. It's got smells. I mean, it is. It's got smells and tastes. Smells and tastes. Wow. The, uh, wow. It does. It, it is very pleasant. I, I, I wish I was better at describing it because that, that smell is, it's, it's good. Yeah. There's some, there's some bourbon you just want to fucking jump mm. inside and crawl yeah. around and live in it. <laughs> this is, this is one of them. <laughs> Yeah, that is a warm hug. Yeah, and it, it it's not rye. You, there's, there's such a difference between the rye spice that sort of hides the ethanol a little bit because yeah. you get that spiciness in this one, which is just ethanol hug. Yeah, it's it yeah it's it's pretty high ethanol for sure, but like not unpleasantly. No, no, yeah. no, no. Yeah, yeah. nice, no, nice. No, it's not like drinking cheap vodka. Nope. This is uh, yeah. So it's unfortunate. To you, William. Yeah. Here's to you. It's just unfortunate it's so fucking expensive, you know? Yeah. Like, I, I um, wouldn't... Yeah, it's almost unattainable. That's why 15... we have a two ounce. Yeah, two ounce of it. Like, $1,500, I just... Going pretty far in this bourbon game, but... Yeah. That just seems excessive. <laughs> Dave has found his limit. Yeah, for one bottle. Mm. Not, not, not for a week. Or anything. Or two bottles. I'm fine. Yeah. And you'll, you'll eventually have a bottle of this. You'll find it. The problem with William and Ruella and all the BTX is they, is they fucking are not rare. Yeah. They're going to come out every fucking year. Yep. There's no reason that they cost as much as they do. Like Coy Hill, fine, because that was a one and done. Maybe mm. they'll do it again. Maybe they won't. But these guys, you know for a fact that there's going to be a Willie Miller Rue Weller 24, 25, 26, 27. They might miss one year, but. But it's so good. So good. I don't want them to not miss. I don't want them to miss a year. They did with GTSA. Like yeah, they did. 2020 or whatever. Mm -hmm. But that was just because quality control. Supply chain issues. That's yeah. why everything else is playing on that year. <laughs> that disease that was made up or something. <laughs> Fake news. Fake news, fake, 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 fake news. I'm the president and you're fake news. <laughs> so this is, this is the ultimate in status symbols of expensive. Yeah. And I mean, I, I, I love Pappy's. You know this. I love Pappy's. It's delicious. I Is it worth the uh, secondary market price? I don't, I don't really think there's so many good whiskeys out there. Yeah. So many good bourbons. I, yeah. Yeah. And you know, like, like I say, is it the best, but I still think the best one I've ever, the best bourbon I've ever tried was when we were in Louisville, Louisville and it was a Pappy's 20, but I do think it was might over matter. It was just cause we were in Louisville and I'd never had Pappy's before, but that shit it was, was like, amazing. It was so expensive. It, and it had was, to be the yeah, best yeah, whiskey yeah, you'd yeah. ever. <laughs> Well, and it was your birthday. Yeah, yeah it's almost birth your birthday again. Yeah, it's your birthday. birthday. Twenty-seven years old. Mm. Looks good on you. Mm. Oh, I love it. Fuck, it's so good. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> that is like it's so good. So good. It's so smooth. So smooth. After those other two. Oh man. Okay, it's not as high proof, but <coughs> still. Yeah. Man, that's good. Tasty. God damn you, Peppy. And the bottle is so cool, like, you know, like my buddy's got a bottle sitting up on a shelf yeah. and it just fucking looks cool. I want one. I don't have it's one. It's classy as. And you, you, know, you walk in, you see a Pappy's in your, I mean, yeah, it's status symbol. Like I said, it's the it's ultimate status. 100% status symbol. <clears throat> we need like, status. How do we get that? I don't know. You buy Pappy's apparently? Mm. Okay. Oh, that's him. Yeah, that's pretty good for... But yeah, it's fifteen hundred bucks for a bottle. Yeah, yeah, fifteen hundred bucks a bottle, and you're probably paying forty, fifty, sixty bucks an ounce at the ch at a cheap place, right? All right, well that's round one. Fucking a. We're going to round <laughs> that two. That didn't suck. Round two is going to be stags. We'll wash these out, but they're yeah. going to be a stag store pick, which I fucking love. That that was a traveling bottle. One twenty nine point eight. Yeah, that's the lowest one here. Oh my god. Oh no, this so this is I was gonna say that's that's high. That can't be the lowest one. Yeah, 23 GTS! 23 GTS and a 2019 GTS. 
So 29 GTS was the lowest GTS stag for a while, but that's actually good. That's really nice. I've been looking forward to this for a while. Yep, and that's the stag you bought me. Happy Cheers, buddy. buddy. Yeah, well, that was happy Christmas, but yeah. Um, so yeah, we're gonna hit some stag and then, uh, but the stall pick was like, it was called traveling bottle. I went, I won it on a Raz, which is like that raffle thing mm. they do. Mm. But uh, the guy who I won it from said, yeah, it's, it had gone all around secondary from selling to Razzes to whatever. No one had ever opened it. They just re razed it or resold it. Mm. Well, I opened the shit out of that and drunk it. <laughs> Here it is. Here it is. We're going to give it a go. All right. Oh, let's, let's shoot. Down. And cut. And cut. <laughs> 